Hey guys, Daily Trouble here, and today, for many of you guys, um, this will be a new video. Uh, this is two different games I have played. There are demos, and I'm happy to welcome y'all back. And let me know how y'all think of this new setup. All right, these two video games that you will be seeing are two different games. They are demos, but one is uh really questionable. <laughs> Because it was, I think it was an adult game, but it says a hard game, which made me confused. But more on that topic later. These two games were demos, or they aren't full, full released. And I can't wait to show y'all more of them. But, um, <laughs> alright guys, before I ramble on, let me say this. Thank you for being here, and I appreciate it. Alright guys, enjoy the video. I'll talk to y'all later, and hope to, hopefully to see y'all next time. Please come visit my streams. I really would appreciate if y'all was there. All right, have a good night and be safe. Hey guys, okay, real quick matches from Future Deadly. Um, this is kind of a funny situation. So, what had happened? I forgot to unmute my mic when I was recording, and. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, this is going to be a weird situation. Sorry about that. Y'all didn't hear me for the first few minutes. If you want to, you know, read what was going on, pause the game. And, you know, read for yourselves. I'm so sorry that this happened. All right, guys. I think this should be my last uh, interruption. Or, well, I think this one for this video for now. But, all right, guys. Uh, enjoy the video. Or enjoy the rest of the video. I'm so sorry that I didn't realize my mic was muted when I... Did my first take. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. All right. I'm moving on before I get lost track. All right, guys. Enjoy. I just realized the mic was muted and that whole entire time I was talking. I am so sorry, guys. <laughs> Once again, this is the demo. I forgot to unmute the mic. <laughs> Major fuck up. But, um, okay, before I continue, guys, this is a demo. I just found it on Steam and I am so sorry, guys. Forgive me, I didn't realize my mic was still muted. I was literally talking. And the model's not showing up, but hey, it's it's fine. Alright guys, let's get a move on. It is barely dump. And it's addressed to you. Oh my dear, my dearest Shipley. Shipley? Shipley? The things you do to me unknowingly, how you hide, how you run, just know it is my nature to have a little fun. You're one and only Wolf Gainton? Sorry, my, my reading is terrible. Alright, there's, there's a cave nearby. Best lay low for a bit. Oh, what is this camera angle? I can't see. <laughs> for real, I mean, I mean that love you, bro. Thanks for being my life. Oh, so fuck you, kid me. <laughs> so fuck you, fuck your face. <laughs> okay, yeah, these controls are gonna fucking bother me. Left shift or right shift to run. Oh yeah, this is gonna fuck with me. Man, these tank controls are gonna really fuck my mind. Uh, honesty, yeah, they're gonna fuck with me. Nothing there, it's closed out.
Yeah, I'm just gonna moonwalk. Stone key. No, that's the hidden letter. It's a tab, right? Yeah, that's to run. I think it's I. It's one of these controls that bring up my. Okay, that's all the other camera angle. That's a stone key. Let's look at my controls. Donkey didn't work. Yeah, open something. Okay, add these these change control. I swear to God, I haven't used controls with these since Resident Evil time, and this is gonna fuck with me on the low. Something is missing. Just heard something unlocked. I don't think there's anything in here for me to grab. Okay, so I can't back up. What did I do? Ah, oh, jeez, man. Sorry, my nose really itches. <laughs> what did I just unlock? I don't... There's nothing... Okay, so there's nothing in my inventory. Oh my god, this game is dark as... Wait. This doesn't bring up any suspiciousness. Wait, there's something over here.
as Donkey. Donkey does not work. Not before doing any of that. I want to see if there's anything over here. Nope, I don't think so. Get that open that up. Anything over here. Anything over here. So, I can see feet up there. Is that feet up there? Pablo. Stuck. And that one's stuck. Is something moving? I did not like that sound. I do not like that sound. There's something in here with me. Oh, I don't like this sound. I do not like this music. A statue blocks the path. Those who wish to proceed, recite the death of oh, oh, the shit. Identify it so that only a few drops on me. Oh, I just realized I was doing that with my mouse this entire time. I could have just used the, the four arrow keys. What the fuck? There's a note on the back of the photo. Oh my dear, sh sh oh my god, Shipley. <clears throat> Why must we play these games? 
perhaps we could meet somewhere and relieve some memory relive some memories. No know of any nice caves yours forever, Sir Wolfington. And I am gonna save the game. That jump scare almost fucking had me. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. let me write this down. Carry on. Okay, so it, because I'm yeah, a little bit too close now. Dears, my dear ship, ship where you belong to me. Game over. Game. Okay, I'm supposed to run. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, it changed. You hear a clink sound. Oh, no way. Carry on. So I gotta be, okay, so I gotta be in first person view. Oh, shit. Careful, I'll fall over. I did not know there was one over there. I just randomly guessed. Okay. Uh, 
Oh my god. Okay, um let's push that back, right? Okay, let's go first person for continue this. There's one over there, one right there, one right there. So let's take the one care of the one in the far back. I'm so scared to fall out this damn water. Alright, push that back. I guess this one now. I'm so scared to fall into this damn water. All that hand yeah, is right there, so. I was so focused on the hand, I fell into the water. Carry on. Ain't no way the hand's down here already, right? Oh my god, he's going through. No way. Oh, that's 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 cheating. That is cheating. That is cheating. Cause the fact that this man hand was going through the fucking things, that was just cheating. Oh yeah, it's cause my hands can magically go through shit. That was that was just cheating. Bro, I'm so tired. Of This is a dead end, right? No, there's a path over here. <laughs> For a moment, everything went dark.
at long last. The end was near. One final confrontation. One last struggle after years of the deadliest dance. In the heat of their defining moment, two bodies hit the floor. Their fur ripped and torn, tore. They finally, they, they wanted nothing more. Pain cast aside and the struggle for love long denied. Oh, Wolfie Tinton, my one and only gentle wall. Won't you show me your gentle? I will, my dearest Shipley. Ah, uh, Jesus Christ. For I, for I love and respect you deeply. Tonight our spirits at long last lock. So now I will show you my... Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. The fans will mean me to death if I release this. Floyd Walton would never be so forward. It's just out of character, really. But maybe not. The client wanted PG-13. And I, I want to get paid. The fact that this is all a fan, I just did all that for a fucking fan fiction. I just did all that for a fucking fan fiction. Are you fucking serious right now? I did all of that for a fan fiction. Ain't that about a bitch? Classes begin in a couple of weeks. I'll make a special edition for the anime club. An email. Kurt uh, Warrington to Amy uh, Chipney. Date. Um, fair. No, fair way. Subject emergency mailed by snitch stitch snitch Ames. I messed up big time. Meet me at the student union that building out your window ASAP. Do not go to sleep. Don't use your phone. Don't tell anyone where you are or where you're going. If they find out where you are, they'll what? <laughs> I don't even want to try to pronounce that. Can I save? At least. Yes, that's the boyfriend. There's a note on the back of this photo. To think six months ago, we were just two random randos editing fanfics. At the time, I remember thinking this has to be a setup. No girl could be this cool. No guy could be this lucky. I would have been fine keeping it at that. But you being here in person, in the in the Mitten State, Mitten State, Amy, thanks for being thanks for being you. Yeah, I'm gonna save just in case. I did not like that camera angle. Fanny pack. Spacious patch for items going typically tied to the, the hip for. The power button on this old telly doesn't work. There is a remote here, but it needs two batteries. Hmm. The screen remains off. I see another room, so I must have a roommate. There's a photo attached to this note. 
Cindy, that's the name. A golden uh, trapping green to all our early arrivals. Welcome back to campus in your lovely home, East Court. By the way, if you forget my name, just use the, the photo. Please excuse the mess around here. I think it's safe. The new university president said she would get things fixed up before summer begins in a few weeks. <clears throat> but just in case I left some equipment in our safes at the common uh, entrance, safe one, a radical timing lock, easy for my hacker drone dormies. A password lock used this semester uh, community theme, the one on the campus TV channel. An apple. Oh, that's so many dorms here. The door is locked. A yellow note on the door reads Jackie. The certain name has been ruined by a tear. Chuck it. This door is locked. You look underneath the door and see a yellow piece of paper out of reach. Yeah, inside the box you find nothing in particular. It's gonna come back and probably bite me in the ass. It's the grave uh, historian. He stands at the center of the campus and he is said to guard the memories of men, especially those who have died alone or forgotten. I think it's also scheduled for removal, but I don't remember why. This safe is labeled too. It takes a digital password. Nothing happened. The digital lock is malfunctioning. Great. Hey, Dorman, stand, stand here. The exit door digital lock just gave me some trouble on the way out. If the same happens to you, use your phone to call the faculties. They will need your full name and room number, so make note of your room number before calling. I also recommend making it a, a quick call. It'll take me later. In my dorm room was back over there. A faint glimmer may be seen midway down the sink. It's under construction. The bottom pipe is exposed, disconnected, and could be and it could use it washing out. No luck. Someone placed a, uh, a name near each door. Okay, so my dorm room is 513. Just like Jay from Cub Scouts, I will be writing down anything I find. 51. Mm-hmm. It's a paper wash washing machine. Some unwashed jeans and a small red object may be seen through the window. Fifty cents is required to open. This is level one. It has a unique digital lock in the shape of a circle. Easy. 
The safe door swings open. Inside was a crowbar. Why the fuck would there be a crowbar in one of the safes? Is our... Okay, I said the same stuff. I don't think that was anything over here. I can go Let's go back to my door. Someone was just in here. Doors jam, it could be pried open. It's sometimes said that American Americans are greedy, but they give away all sorts of cool things for free. It's not extremely help health healthcare, but as far as it speaks to me. A rest of panel is held against the wall with a tiny screw. My a smartphone. Water. A, okay. Space for my fanny pack. That's not that's uh not Nostra Step Nova, one of my favorite artists. I wonder what, what she's laughing at. Probably your demise in a few seconds. This door gives me the creeps. It won't open. It doesn't even have a lock. The uh, chest contains an intro book. Um, Is that mole? Wait, was the lights always off? Beep beep. The phone connected fell, perhaps due to the security hello office of remote we won't be fully operational for a couple of weeks 
As far as anyone on campus, call this early now. What you want? The, the door to the unit was broken. You're kidding. Another goddamn door. F uh, fire Michelle is gonna shit himself. Okay, girl. Room number, if you don't mind. I need room numbers for security. Punk kid tried to impersonate someone just last week. I'm 513, if I remember correctly. First name. Last name, I think that's surname to you. Okay, let me get this straight. You're Amy C. You're going. Okay, let's see here. The name doesn't. Surname is Oh, he followed me into the room. Thanks for the call, Miss Chipley. We thought you were out and about. How kind of, how kind to give yourself away. <laughs> Did you think you could leave? It's not over. The bloody pro um, promotion began. It's fading from your mind. You're safe again. Was it just a dream? Oh wait, the bo oh my god, the bottle of water. I just realized the bottle of water. Give me one second, guys. The bottle of water. It just hit me. Use these two quarters on the oh my god, the puzzle in this game. You find a bat, you find a battery, it isn't, and then that's the two TV batteries. Oh my god, this game's gonna be a fucking puzzle. Is going to change our time. Despite the steep budget cuts sweeping compass, community leaders are embracing the average theme like never before. Southern Michigan's new president was recently appointed via state emergency protocol was on hand to celebrate. President K. In these difficult times, we must unite as one and embrace the average. In other words, in other news, the uh, Spanish officers announced a new campus record. 
with the latest non-male identifying students. Now, <clears throat> now present over 70.7% of campus is escalating. A celebration is being planned to commemorate this historic um, milestone in campus quality and then student anger's return to talking about average student stuff there. Screen is so fun. Okay. So there was a puzzle to the TV. Could it be seven oh seven, maybe? Let's look back at that note real quick. It's a theme, okay. So it has to be the word average. Thank God. Because I'll use the phone again. <laughs> Jesus. 
someone's been watching us. As a camera. Sam McDirk King. That name will come back later to haunt me, won't it? My doormate's window is boarded up. Yeah, we still need to figure out what the hell that room is. Wall chart, a chart found in the neighbor's room. The length of the dot is one unit. A dash is three units. A space. You feel like you remember the new president's name yourself, but it's make copies for Cold Breaker Thursday. Practice pronouns for the new. Can't see where I'm going. Game over. All right, I had enough of this. Well, that game was fun, but uh, I'm going to move on. <laughs> oh, man, that game took so long. <laughs> hey, guys. Dilly Trouble here, and today I am playing Father, What Have You Done? Apparently, it's supposed to be some horror game. I don't know. I really don't know what this is supposed to be. Like, it says a horror game, but then it says... Well, it's a hard game, but it, it looks like one of those, like, adult games you find on Steam. What? But, I digress, but let's try it out and have some fun, alright? <clears throat> Disclaimer. What Have You Done, Father? was developed by a single person with a limit, limited budget. It offers a native focus experience with a strong emphasis on storytelling, exploration, and cement elements. This is a demo. Some scenes may appear empty, and some assets are currently um, presented by our placeholders. <coughs> Excuse me. This will change upon release. The, uh, the game features content that includes violence, nudity, flashing lights, and disturbing imagery. It also uh, derails into sensitive religious and moral themes. Please be aware that these elements are... Uh, Integral to the game story. Okay. I mean, this game looks gorgeous. Maybe I should put myself all to the side, maybe? 
you know, not put myself on th this site. All right. All right, let's give the game a try. I just realized I can move. I just literally just realized I can move. I was sitting here thinking like I was gonna be like a whole ass cutscene. Is that a goat? Yeah, it's a lamb. Lamb with a Jesus Christ crucifix. What have you done, Father? Oh, this is gonna be one interesting game. A long time ago, somewhere in Transylvania. Transylvania. I mean, this game is kind of gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie. I have no sins to confess. I've come here to speak the truth. My conscience is as clear as a child's. I have been framed and almost driven to insanity. But I am resolute in my faith. Mm hmm. Interesting, interesting. Earlier that day. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. Hmm. Hello? Hello. Is this Father Matthias? Yes, speaking. How may I assist you? This is Marina Constanza. I'm a member of your parish, though I think it's unlikely you know me. I'm not much of a churchgoer. Oh, it may seem weird for me to come out of nowhere and ask for your help. I'm not even a good Christian. Banish the thought. God, in his infinite mercy, takes care of all his children. But please... Tell me more about what's troubling you. Thank you, Father. You're too kind, but I'd rather not talk on the phone about my situation. I'd like to meet you in person if possible. It is a, well, a delicate matter. Can I come by? I live not far from there. Oh, certainly. I've just finished my prayers and I'm about to prepare some tea. Do you have any preferences? You're too kind. A cup of strawberry tea would be lovely. Right, then I'll be expecting you. If I'm not available, Felix, one of my students, will assist you until I return. Thank you. I'll see you soon. God bless, and be safe on your way here. I recall it well. It was a few days before Christmas, just after Vespers. The distant sound of the organ in the nearby chapel filled the air as I readied myself to meet Lady Marina. Chat this out, this, guys. This is how it starts. The priest turns out to be a nice person. 
I've been working on my study about uh, um, uh, sorry, my mouth. I had some in my mouth. If uh, rec uh, rec trees, rec trees pass. If I have time, I hope to finish it. Finish it one of these days. Mm. Yeah, no, you not know, crap. Uh, slick transit gala. Mm. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. I'm pretty sure every priest has fucked God in one way or another. I see my hat disappearing in the background. I saw that. Every time I move, my hat just magically disappears. Is there no greater privilege in this world than a dean oneself to serving our Lord? Ah, oh, jeez, man. I'm guessing that's my student. I'll take a shower later for now. I should prepare some tea for Lady Mara. Father Jonathan? John? Johns? Father Johns. He was the lo longest serving priest in the office with undisciplined sign. He fought against a a band of thieves in the city. This got the better of him and concluded in his strange appearance. Never be never to be seen again. Rumors have speculated that he may have left overseas to escape the vendetta he had on his head the uh mm. entering through this room without an invitation would be impolite. Felix. Uh, so this must be Felix. <coughs> Fuck boy. <coughs> Twink. <coughs> Fan boy. <coughs> God bless you. How are you? God bless. I'm enjoying what might be my final day of this year with beautiful weather. I just returned from a lousy stroll through the park. I heard on the radio that a massive storm is approaching, perhaps even tonight. They are for forecasting it to be the most powerful one in the last few years. I just hope it doesn't wreck, ha wreck havoc. By the way, Father, uh, Joseph mentioned your struggles with severe migraines. Are you feeling better? Is everything all right? I'm fine. It's just the weather. I see. Lately, the the winters have indeed become incredibly unpredictable. But one day it's warm and sunny, only for the next day to bring rain and sharp drop, sharp drop in uh, temperature. Mm, I'm making some tea. Do you want to join me? Uh, God bless you. How are you? I said that already. I would love to gossip over tea. Make sure you don't put too much sugar in it. Unfortunately, I have to help the sisters at the con convent with gluing the new wallpaper. Gluing the new wallpaper. I'll be leaving in an hour. Take care and see you around. Who the fuck are you? I have purchased this. Okay, dear, um, I have purchased this strawberry tea pack for you as a token of gratitude. Your guidance means a lot. From your humble, no voice, novice, Felix. 
I have a theory that Felix is going to try to fuck the father. I received another certificate of appreciation last year. I thought about taking it down, but Felix insists that I humble myself and acknowledge my um, my what my uh wealth. I should uh, I should look into revamp reinvent uh, reinventing the basement. There's some serious issues with the the mole and the humidity. humidity. I feel feeling like Felix is going to try to fuck the father or something. I'm not going anywhere. I'm waiting for a lady. Okay. Seeing for Christmas. God bless. Well, I can't call this place home. I like it here very much, especially during Christmas. It brings back pleasant memories from my childhood when times were better. But anyway, how are you? You look a bit pale. I'm fine. Praise the Lord. I'm just tired-ish. What the fuck? Sorry, chap. If y'all heard that, I had a... I had a bug crawling on me. I'm tired, huh? Hee hee hee. The long... The long winter nights can leave one restless... I've had my share of insomnia too. I usually go to the chapel and pray. It's strange how sleep overwhelms you when you try to pray the to the Lord. Um, temptations have bothered me since or uh, order ordination as well, but I try to resist them. Confession is the best uh, redeeming in situations like this. Perhaps I'll even go and confess to the bishop later. There are a few things that have been bothering me. But we'll talk sometime later about this. Sometime about this. Sure, I am making some tea. You want to join me? Hmm. Right now I have to go to the conveyor belt. Convent. To uh, convent. And help. Covent. And help the the nuns glue some new wallpaper. And there's still a lot of work in the hallway, and they want it finished by Christmas Eve. Maybe later tonight. Later tonight, it is. Do you know a certain lady Mara from your from our parish? From our parish, you said hmm. I think I know who you're referring to. Yes, I'm not per per personally equating with her because she doesn't attend church frequently, but I believe she, I saw her once or twice. I remember spotting her in the back of the church on one or two occasions during the Holy Mass. She seemed incredibly emotional, her gaze fixed towards the, the altar. A beautiful young lady, but clearly in profound sorrow. I assume she must have lost someone. But who can say for sure you're curious about her? If you are curious about how I know her name, it's because I overheard people gossiping, gossiping rumors. Oh, Jesus. Rumors, you say? What kind of rumors? Rumors indeed. Apparently, she is very um, discreet with her life, and many suspect that she has been an incredible fortune which she acquired through her family's what family's uh, wise but i won't be too quick to judge some say that during the war she may have married a nazi officer and now she is embarrassed others others that she is simply a very emotional and mentally unsta unstable person who knows poor thing we should pray for her I agree. It is the only way we can help people like her. God forgive me if I have stirred through my my words. I'll leave for the um, covenant to help the nuns. Perhaps we will see each other again this evening after I return. God blessings. I'm going to see his expression. 
Placing the T service here will be will come in handy. Blueberry tea. Okay, so I got the strawberry one now. That's I for inventory. Mm. A liner? Plus in tea service here will come handy. And then back door to the uh, room was a wise choice offering us a more private entrance and exit away from the constant attention of the neighbors. Now, why would you want some privacy from the neighbors? Are you worried that the neighbors might see you doing something that you might not like? Maybe upstairs, maybe? Yeah, it was definitely fair. The only fragrance of this beautiful scent is oil fills the room. Oh man, here we go. Good evening. My name is Marina. We talked about it on the phone. Good evening, and God bless us. I am our Father, I am our Mother, at your service. Good afternoon, so you are. Esteen Father Marcus, Marcus Martin. Please excuse me if this seems impolite. As I tell you, I'm not much of a church going, and perhaps I look, perhaps I lack some some of the um, aesthetic required in in situations like these. No worries. Uh, you are so kind. <clears throat> Yeah, step straight. Where's the kind you have always been treated as a spore? As a spar? Spore. As a, okay. I was thrown from one side to another. People took advantage of me ever since I was a child. It was horrific, you know. I am wounded despite to find so, um,. So let's forgive me if I'm rumbling. I'm taking. I'm talking too much again. Oh, is there anyone else in here? Perhaps I should keep my voice down. Don't worry, we are alone. I see. Oh, as I told you, I am at a loss. I have no one. I feel like I'm going to make a mistake if I'm not saved one way or another. But I wanted to confess my sins. But to to my shame, I have almost never been to church. I used to rely on. Horoscopes, superstitions, fortune tellers, and the likes of these. Oh, there's so much I want to share with you, but what? But what's that? I sent strawberry. I sense or smell. Oh yes, the tea is. The tea must be ready. Oh my! Such a lovely place. I always wondered how priests live, all by themselves. Must be terribly lonely. We try to keep things simple. Father, I'm curious. Do peace engulf, indulge in, you know, vicious, various social pleases? 
I mean things like smoking, drinking, a glass of wine, perhaps listening to music, something other than other than church organ. Some do, some don't. I'm rather I, I'm rather mm. Forgive me, Father, my questions may seem silly. Thank you for the tea. It is delicious and refreshing. It is me we should be talking we should be talking about. How should I begin? I know this is deeply wrong, but I feel helpless. It's been a while now, and I don't know how much longer I can keep going like this. I don't know how to put it, put this in a way that won't sound shameful. I'd rather be blunt, Father. It concerns you. Me, dear Lord, in what way? I feel something burning deep in my heart. Ever since you arrived at, at this parkish i lie and told you the truth at the same time when i said i'm not a church goer in fact all my life i have been devoted to the virgin mary i prayed the rose the rosary every night and even wanted to enter the convert the con convent convent but then you showed up from that from that day on I couldn't bring myself to attend mass and to see you. The few times I have been to church all these years, I couldn't help but feel this overwhelming rush of uh, of emotions. I know it's not right, but the truth is, the truth is that I love you, Father, with all my hope, with all my hope being in from the bottom of my heart. I don't know what to say. Considering your feelings, and I don't want to be callous, but it's just not possible. What can I say? I'm not good at discussing romantic love between a man and a woman. I can preach to you about the love of God. I understand, Father. I understand. Oh, I feel so naive. And I should not come here. I'm the only one to blame for this embarrassment. You shouldn't talk like that. There's no shame in loving someone. But not like this. We can still be friends in Christ. Oh, spare me that talk. I don't need a sermon. Pour me a glass of wine and I'll be on my way.
that was the last thing I expected. But in retrospect, Felix always was a bit nosy. resist her charms. If only I weren't a priest. We could have been together, but I had to send her What terrible chain of events could have led to this? I trembled, overwhelmed by an uncontainable fear. The entire house was spinning with me. I was in deep trouble. guys i hope y'all enjoyed that little treat that was just for the video all right it's late and it's nighttime i'm trying not to wake anybody else up in the house but um hope you guys enjoyed that little video i tried to edit out as much as i can but eh all right guys have a good day and good night i'll talk to y'all later and i want to see y'all here next time all right good night everybody <laughs>